The Holocaust, a word that we hear all the time. But what do you really know about what happened in the Holocaust? And actually, what happened to Jews in the Holocaust? In World War II, the Nazis, led by Hitler, led a series of massacre against minority groups with the goal of building a superior white race. Their main ultimate priority? Eliminating the Jews. The program for exterminating the Jews was called the Final Solution and was carried out by creating ghettos concentration camps, and ultimately death camps to make Europe Judenrein, Jew-free. Jews were robbed, humiliated, beaten, even sent to gas chambers. Over six million Jews were murdered, a number that if we held one minute of silence for the victims of the Holocaust, we would be silent for 11 and a half years. But the Holocaust didn't occur hundreds of years ago. It happened in our generation, just eight decades ago. At first, no one could have believed that this guy, Hitler, could really commit a genocide. But it began with boycotts and incitement and ended with murder. By remembering what happened, we can help prevent atrocities in the future. After all, what happened to the Jews in the Holocaust could happen to anyone today. That's why Holocaust education is so important. Talking about it now is protecting you and the next generation. Because very soon, Holocaust survivors like Rina won't be able to provide testimony. I'm the only survivor in my family. So who can ensure never again is a reality? Here in Israel, there are multiple museums focusing on the Holocaust, such as the Ghetto Fighters House that documents the stories of those who resisted the Nazis. There is also the official Holocaust Museum, Yad Vashem in Jerusalem, which provides resources and materials to show the whole world what happened in 22 different languages, including Arabic. because each of us has a role to play in Holocaust education as well. Because it concerns all of us, Jews, Arab, all of us. That's why I do my part to educate about the Holocaust. I created the organization Together Vouch for Each Other and teamed up with the organization Zikaron Basalon a few years ago to ensure the stories of survivors were shared on Holocaust Memorial Day in our Arab community and the Arab world. I did my part to educate about the Holocaust. What about you?